There was a big battle that happened the other day that I was at. Uh-huh. Big, big K and Murder Mook. Okay. Who you feel like won that battle? I didn't see the whole battle. I only saw clips. I didn't. I didn't order the pay per view, and I, you know, what I'm saying it wasn't. It wasn't no hating or none of that. I just. I wasn't around. I was traveling that day, so I didn't get to see it. Um, I saw clips. I can't. I. I truly. You know, what I'm saying can't judge. You know, what I'm saying. I, okay. Yeah, I'm out. That's, I'll, that's real. That's I don't real. know who won it. You know what I'm saying? Do you answer the questions all the time? If you did see the battle, would you actually answer? Yeah, I, I would definitely say who I fucking felt lost, bro. I don't bite my tongue, bro. I know you know this yeah. by now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that nigga, bro. I'm not him. I'm not the guy that's gonna bite my tongue. I truly didn't see the battle, man. Shout out to ARP. That's my guy. You know, I wanted to support, but again, I was right. moving. I was, I was, I was in transit, so I, I, I actually couldn't, you know, get a chance to see it, and I haven't had the time yet. Every time we're on the Danza Project, the shit is live. So if they're watching us, it's always live. Just yeah, understand yeah. that shit. Nothing about it is fake. This shit, at first when we set this shit up, I'm like, man, is this, is this really going to be sustainable? Could we always go live? Do we have to go right. and do the editing shit? And I was like, I don't want to do that. I just want to go natty. You know what I'm saying? I'd rather do just it. do this shit natural. Right. Because yeah. I'm only here to have a conversation. I, ain't, I, I don't want to do the fake shit. I don't give right. a fuck about the viral moment. Fuck right, the right. viral moment. Absolutely. As a fan, I'm a businessman, so if the podcast money comes in, cool. You know what I'm saying? I th- I, I'm excited because we made like $500 off of YouTube this Let's week. Go. I'm like, oh, shit, we made $500 <laughs> off YouTube. Right. But, I, but I, I'm not somebody that doesn't understand what it's like. You know what I'm saying? You, it's a business. And when, when I'm talking to you, it's a business. You can't just sit here and... and, and Yo, why don't you come over to the podcast and do this shit for free? What kind of bullshit is that? If right. it was always like, if you're talking to an artist that is established, that has a life, that has a career, and I'm gonna sit there and be like, yo, just come do this shit for free. Right. You know what I'm saying? Just it's always No, nah, it's it's you know what's crazy? When you when people see that you actually are about business, they certain people, my myself being one of these type of people, when I see somebody lead with business and I know that they are literally about what they got going on and what they believe in. That's when, you know what I'm saying, I'll do business with them, and then that's how the relationship grows and, and business become. That's where the favors come in after. But mm-hmm. as long as I know you, you uh, like, because that's how I am. When I, If I need something, I'm going to hit somebody and be like, bro, what's, what does it take to do this? I don't never ask just for the favor. A lot of my friends and features and shit that I got came off with, nah, nigga, I wouldn't even do that. But I still lead with, you know what I mean, what Absolutely, it's going to take. Absolutely, yeah. What will it take me to get this done? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's because you come correctly, though. So That's and, how you got to initiate. And that's what I'm saying. And then from there, it's like, all right, they came at me. You know what I'm saying? It was straight business. The business was handled. You know what? Let me let me look them out. Yeah. That's how, that's, that's how shit go. As a fellow businessman, that's how it is. Because you appreciate other people that stand on business and that handle themselves correctly. Absolutely. And based off what you're saying, it sounds like you've been doing business the right way for a long time. Long time. Long and that's time. when the favors come in. That's when people say, nah, bro, you know what? It's off the love this time, man. Because right. you did right the first time you came correct. Absolutely. The first time. That's how, you, that's how it should be. Off the love. Like that Chris Brown feature. Chris Brown, you better put that song out too, bro. <laughs> Oh, shit. We done did this Come shit on. years ago, man. <laughs> Come on. Real talk. It was off the love, though. I, I, you know what I'm saying? Respectfully. 